Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Sage Lewis coming to you from the American Association of Airport Executives Social Media Summit 2012 here in Alexandria, Virginia. There is a ton of information going on. We're learning a lot. And today I am with John Purnell of Inspired Data Solutions. How's it going, John? Very fine. Thanks so much, Sage. My pleasure. So you are not an airport. You are not an airport executive per se. Is that right? Correct. Yeah. And what brings you here to the uh, the social media summit? Oh, we're just trying to learn more about social media. We do a lot of work for airports. Mm -hmm. We do a lot of uh, consulting, business process consulting, a lot of information technology consulting, and we see sort of a confluence of all that. So the social media thing seems to be the next big gig. So we're trying to get on top of that and make sure we understand all the options we have. I'd love learning how to do a video today. That's something I didn't know this morning. Sweet. <laughs> yeah, um, now that you know how, do you think you will incorporate video like into your website and that sort of thing? Does that thing seem like something that would be applicable to your business? Uh, we might incorporate it in our website. Yeah, yeah. that's a possibility. I, I'd be more interested in, in helping airports find ways to use video effectively. Um, in terms of like training programs, that's one of the big mm. things we're seeing is that even inside the airport, um, there's a lot of things to learn. There's a lot of programs that require that the employees maintain, you know, up, uh, current levels of certification. And in making that training available, even on YouTube in a public way, the employees can still download it, look at it. It's faster, better, cheaper than almost any other alternative the airport has today. Yeah. So it's interesting talking to you because you're a B2B company. You're servicing uh, businesses, correct? Well, technically, I'm a B2G. B2G. Most airports classify as government entities. Oh, okay, okay. Right? So, but a similar type of thing, oh, I yeah, suppose. Yeah. I'm not right? a, com I'm not you're a not consumer. A consumer. I've never been a consumer. Yeah. Guy. So from that perspective, how do you think social media plays? Do you think it is, is more important in a B2C environment than a B2B or B2G environment? Um, I think we don't know yet. Hmm. I, I, I really think that as the, I think it's probably strongest in the B2C at the moment. Mm -hmm. In fact, honestly, it's strongest in the C2C, right? Mm -hmm. If we were to look at it, mm -hmm. people are talking to people and businesses are trying to figure out how to use it effectively. Mm -hmm. They know these channels are there. And what a lot of this session is about is trying to find the effective way to use it. So we have a lot of B2C, we see an increasing amount of B2B, and I'm seeing this in airports. I'm seeing a change from talking from about uh, the passengers to talking to the tenants, to talking to the air carriers, to mm. talking to local government uh, about situations, and, and we're seeing, what I'm starting to see is a number of communities of interest arriving on the social media scene and this is gonna put new stresses on how airports deal with social media because it's no longer a one size fits all. Mm -hmm. Does yeah. that make sense? Oh, it makes perfect sense. So, you know, in that, in that regard, you are extending the, the relationships, all different kinds of relationships. It can pertain to all different kinds of people, I would say. Amen, it's about relationships. It's mm -hmm. all about relationships, relationships with the employees. Yeah. So yeah, we're seeing a lot of that, that going on. Yeah. Uh, so far in the social media summit, is there uh, one aspect that you, uh, you know, something you learned that was impressive to you? Um, I enjoyed the Twitter session a fair amount because we talked about tools, we brought the tools up. I got a chance to play with some of the tools and I, I think one of the things we're going to do to improve our practice is, is put more tools in and actually monitor our client airports on a full-time basis hmm. and just make sure we know what's being said about them and how it's being said and and we might look for some special keywords that i might not otherwise know to look for but uh it might be very helpful for our clients for us to call them up and say hey guess what i just saw on, on tweet tech yeah so using it as a listening engine to understand your customers a little bit better I, I, I didn't learn that here today. I came with that knowledge, but yeah. I'm a great believer this is about listening. Yes. The big change in social media is that we're getting away from the trumpet megaphone approach to how to communicate with the travelers. And we're at the point where we can shut up and listen to what they have to say and interact with them. And yet the interaction is a broadcast. Yeah. So it's a perfect mix of listening and sending the message out. And I heard that quite a lot of people are, are tuned into that. That's really cool. Yeah. It's a very interesting time to be in the business world to see how this is all evolving. Wouldn't you agree? Well, I think for you too as well. I mean, you're, yeah. you're finding a very interesting world of video and getting video out there and how to make video right. And I completely agree with you that video is the next big step mm -hmm. and how we make video commonplace on everybody's desktop in the workplace isn't there yet. Yeah. But, but it will be, and our goal is to be there when it is. Yeah. 
You know, I am, uh, I guess, blessed would be the word that I do something that I love. You know, I'm running my own business. I'm able to do something I love. And I, and social media allows me to express that love. I, you know, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm an outgoing person. Really? And it, no, it's surprising. <laughs> I know. I, I, you know, I'm I know. Stunned. It's so it's surprising. Like yes, <laughs> exactly. Exactly. And so, and I think it, it translates when you can see people that, that, that love what they do and it, and, and it shows. And, and, and I think people want more of that. They want more passion and, and care in the world. Um, I feel the same way. I feel blessed as you are that I have a chance to, to, to play at the intersection of the way people work in business and the technologies they use. And I hope that everybody, if they're not feeling that in their job today, goes and finds it. Word. All right, everybody, as you can see, there is a ton of really cool thoughts going on here at the Social Media Summit at the AAAE. This has been a really great uh, session. You can check it out on Twitter, on their website. It's really great stuff. All right, everybody, I'm Sage Lewis, the web marketing video guy, and happy marketing.